everybody, what's going on? I am GamerChick, and I'd like to welcome you guys back to more of World's Dawn. Now, this game has yet to release. It releases on the 25th of January, which is in just a few days. And I was given a pre-release copy of the game by the developer to play it for my channel. So, if you guys think this might be a game that you're interested in, I will leave the links to their official website and the Steam page down below. Again, the game releases on January 25th of this year, so be sure to pick yourself up a copy if you kind of like what you see, or if you're a fan of um, or Harvest Moon games, because uh, this is a... Uh, this is, I don't, I don't want to say it's a variation of Harvest Moon because this is its own game, but it was inspired by Harvest Moon. So, if you're a fan of those types of games, you'll probably enjoy this one. So, we're going to go ahead and load the story that I was previously playing on. So, we played for about an hour or so. And uh, what's going on is that we need to meet, I think, two more residents of Sugar Blossom Village? I think two. Yeah, it's two. Right now I need to figure out how to get back home. I don't I don't remember. Um, after we meet the other residents of Sugar Blossom Village, we're supposed to return to the mayor, and the mayor is supposed to give us another task? At least that's what I've gotten from that. Uh, so... I need to figure out how to get back to my house so that way we can go home and go to sleep. Okay. So I need to go to the right. Let's go this way. This way! And then up, I think. Willow Creek. Yes, this, this seems right. This seems right. Okay, let's go ahead and go inside of our little home here. Which is just up ahead, and then we will turn in for the night. Okay, so we have... What, what's wrong? Can I go inside? There we go. So we've met pretty much the entire village, with the exception of two uh, residents, who I'm pretty sure are at, like, the, the flowery place. Um, let's go ahead and turn in for the night. One's a florist, and... Oh, remember, accomplishing special feats around town will register them in your Mark's journal and unlock secrets. That's interesting to know. That is very, very good to know. Oh, it's raining. Oh, I brought my dog inside! Beautiful! Dog! Hi, cat! I named my dog cat, yeah. <laughs> I named my dog cat, guys. So, there's that, if you missed that um, particular part. Let's go ahead and put some doggy chow in his bowl, and I'm gonna go ahead and double check on our villager checklist, because I'm pretty sure, let's see, the rancher and the florist, Annabelle and Marion, and I'm pretty sure they're both in the same area, so let's go ahead and go outside, it's raining, which is cool, because we have yet to experience rain, hey, who's that? Hello? Who you be? <gasps> Good morning, Lori. I thought I would stop by and see how you were doing. Ahem. I hope you're getting used to life here. How have your first few days in Sugar Blossom gone for you? I love it here, or I'm still adjusting. I'm gonna go with I love it here. <laughs> you're not just saying that for an old mayor's benefit, are you? What a lovely answer. Anyway, I thought you might be able to use these old fishing supplies. The rivers and ponds of Sugar Blossom are full of healthy fish. Oh, we got a fishing rod. That's pretty cool. And juicy bait. Like, worms. Without a landing net, you'll only be able to catch one fish at a time. Unfortunately, there isn't anywhere to purchase one at the moment. It's such a shame. Oh, it's such a shame that Wake, a dear friend and our town's fishing guru, was recently made to move away. He used to run a wonderful shop over in Fisherman's Spring. Yeah, I, I, found, I found the house. Pardon me, getting misty-eyed with memories of old friends, it's difficult to accept when someone is forced to leave Sugar Blossom. I hope you're able to master the art of fishing with that equipment. A bright young lass such as yourself should have no trouble at all. If you run out of bait, you can always use your digging spade to find more in the dirt. So you can dig up worms, essentially. Okay. Good day, Lori. See you in town. Okay, well, I see some grapes over there glowing. So we're actually going to go over there and pick those up before we go hunt down these other two villagers that we have yet to meet. 
Yes, grapes. Good, good. Okay. So, um, again, one is a florist and one is a rancher. Oh, there's a flower, too. Let's go pick that up. I'm going to assume that we can eventually, like, ship the stuff that I find, right? Oh, that's just whatever. Okay, I thought that was the map. Here we go. Here's the map. Okay, so we need to go to Sunflower Farm, right? I think that's right. That's where I'm going, so let's go ahead and I guess run that away. I probably should try to conserve my energy. But you can regenerate energy in a couple different ways. This way, up here? Is this where I need to go? I don't think this is right. Pretty sure I've already met you, but hi. Refreshing to stand outside in the rain, isn't it? Some folks don't like the damp, but I think it makes the whole world come alive. Well, isn't that nifty? Okay, oh! Wait, 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 wait. You. I'm pretty sure I've met you. There's no way I'm gonna let a little rain get in the way of my daily roots. Oh, she's the, she's the postal person. Okay, is this the Logan's house? Oh, this is Logan's house. Can we, can we go say hi? I can! I can go say hi to Logan. Except he's not here. He has a ball here, though. Let me just go up here and kick it. Can I kick it? I can't kick it. Can I kick it? I can't. It won't let me kick it. That's not good. I like to kick balls around, man! Alright, well. Let's go see if we can find this rancher and the florist. Again, I'm pretty sure the florist is up here somewhere. This is Sunflower Farm. Um, is this the florist? This is the farm shop. Have we been in there yet? I don't remember. I do not remember. Um, did I go the wrong way? What time are they open? They're open nine. Okay, we'll come back here. I shall return. I will. Just gonna try to stop running. Don't want to use all my energy up. I've already used like half of it. Man, gotta get some power up things to give me more energy. That would be nice. Okay, let's go this way. Sure, we can go this way. Okay, what's honey bray pasture? Yeah, let's go that way. Let's go to the pasture. The pasture. I will find these people one way or another. I'm pretty sure this is not where I need to be. Hello? Hello? Have I have I met you yet? Hi. Howdy. Howdy, I'm Marion. It's great to meet you. Yes, Marion, the rancher. Okay, I met another resident of Sugar Blossom Village. Marion works at Honey Bray Pasture, where she cares for all kinds of beasts and birds. Barley didn't mention that you were such a cute young thing. You be sure to speak up if you ever need anything around town. Okay, well that leaves one more villager to go. And again, I'm pretty sure it's at the flower shop. Um, so we just have to make it to there. Make it there before closing. Is there anything back here? Oh, they keep their door locked, okay. Pretty sure we've been in here before though. No, we just gotta go see the florist. And I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure I know where that's at. I just wasn't able to go in there. At least I think, I think that's right. Um, I really need another map. Let's see, let's go back up this way. And is that is that a map or is that just a board? Yeah, no, that's just a board or whatever. Okay, um... I don't know, I feel like... This is Sunflower Farm, yeah. I feel like it's up here. I feel like it's this way. Sunflower farm. Here we go. I'm going inside. Hello? <laughs> oh, hey, it's great to see someone new in Sugar Blossom. I'm Annabelle, but feel free to call me Anna. Okay, met a marriage candidate. Annabelle works at Sunflower Farm with her family, planting and tending to various crops and flowers. I'm sure you'll see, or I'm sure I'll see you around your farm if you're going to be fixing up Noah's old ranch. We sell all sorts of crops and seeds. Okay, spe uh, social creature, achievement unlocked. Yay! Yay! I unlocked an achievement. One of my goals for this game is to unlock all the achievements, but I'm not sure how difficult that may be because I haven't looked at the achievement yet. 
like the achievement list yet, but I, I know there are achievements for it because I've, I've been unlocking them, obviously. And um, they are listed on the Steam page too, so there is that. That's also nice. It's always nice to unlock achievements and whatnot. Okay, so we need to go see the mayor. So we need to go... Does he live in the East Village, I think? I think he's in the East Village. So let's go ahead and walk over there turn in this task that we were given and then maybe oh a mushroom let's go down here and get that mushroom I will pick up the mushroom wild mushroom thank you okay and then maybe he will give us another task there's a flower that I can pick up cool just finding all sorts of goodies mayor mayor you it looks like you've met everyone. Splendid job. And now that you have, I received the village primer. That booklet contains profiles of each and every sugar blossom villager. I've already filled it out with names and brief biographies. You know, that would have been useful to have before you gave me just the list. It's all right, I suppose. You can also use the village primer to keep track of your relationships. The closer you are to a specific villager, the more rainbow ribbons you'll find on his or her profile. Sugar Blossom is a wonderful place to forge true friendships. This book should help you get started right away. <coughs> Pardon my cough, this blasted scratch in my throat just won't leave me be. In any case, well done introducing yourself to the fine villagers of Sugar Blossom. I am certain they'd appreciate such pleasant greetings. Take care, I am off to rest for a while. Perhaps a short nap will calm my throat. Should I go check on him? He's like not, he's not dying or anything, is he? Hold on a moment, Lori. Oh boy. That's Dimitri, right? You heard my father's cough, didn't you? I'm worried about him. My mother usually makes him a bowl of stew on days like this, but it would be nice if she didn't always have to. Could I ask you a favor for my father, really? Do you think you could cook up, a, uh, cook up a bowl of his favorite piping stew? I would do it myself, but I honestly don't know the first thing about cooking. Maybe Orion over at the Midnight Tavern would help us. Thank you. I know that my father would really appreciate it. So when do I actually get to do like some farming stuff? Okay, this is a shop. Is this the tavern? I'm pretty sure it's just a shop. It says shop on it. Yeah, this is just the general shop. That's the post office. I'm pretty sure the tavern is on this side of the village. Already learning where things are. That's good. That's Dimitri's house. This is the, here we go. Yeah, Midnight Tavern. Ah, oh, it's not open yet. When does it open? It opens at two. Of course it opens at two. Well, I guess while I'm waiting, let's go ahead and take a look at the village primer. This should be interesting. Oh, there's characters we haven't unlocked yet. Okay, so who was one of the marriage people? Favorites? Huh. That's pretty cool. It gives like an actual Haley. Aha. Okay, so the ones with the hearts are the ones that are marriage candidates. Okay, so I want you to guys to actually pick who we should romance in this game. So we've got Hunter. This is Hunter. Uh, Hunter is a hardworking young man who acts as an apprentice to his Uncle Benjamin at their local craft shop in Willow Creek. He harbors boundless enthusiasm and is constantly full of energy and a fiery vigor for life. Hunter gets restless easily when working inside behind the counter and prefers to be out and active as much as possible. So there's Hunter. Um, Annabelle, or just Anne, works at the local farm, watering and arranging all sorts of crops and flowers. She is reserved, polite, and introverted. Someone who tends to prefer quiet evenings over noisy, active nights. Annabelle enjoys both reading and writing, and loves the peaceful, poetic nature of Sugar Blossom. So we got Hunter and Annabelle. We have Haley. Haley is an upbeat and passionate animal lover who cares for the livestock at Honey Bray Pasture with her parents. She has a competitive spirit and an inquisitive nature and is always trying to learn and discover new things. Haley has always wondered about the world outside of Sugar Blossom but is happy spending her days on her family's ranch. So we've got Hunter, Annabelle, 
and Haley. And I think there's one more. I don't remember. Let's see. Brian? Oh, okay. Brian always tries to squeeze the most out of life by drinking and socializing at the local inn. She loves to have a good time, but turns serious and professional when it comes to her role as the town's mixology expert. Brian is quick and clever and regularly encourages her neighbors to lighten up and enjoy the simple joys of life in Trick Blossom. So that's three females and one male. Um, there's gotta be more. Liam! Oh, I forgot about Liam. Liam is a young, brilliant doctor who operates the Wild Rose Clinic and works hard to ensure the health of the local villagers. With the help of his sister-in-law, Madison, he keeps his clinic open at all hours of the day and night because of his admirable devotion to helping people. He is a good-natured and respectful person who cares deeply about Sugar Blossom. Okay, and I think... Let's see. Sparrow? Is he the last one? Yeah, Sparrow. Sparrow is a talented cook who runs the town bakery in West Village. He is sensitive and soft-spoken, and his, his fierce devotion to his ill sister shows just how much family and loved ones mean to him. Sparrow appreciates the quiet independence of kitchen work and is always looking to discover the great uh, the next great dish. So I want you guys to kind of choose who you guys want me to like romance in this series. It can be either a female or a male. It's all for fun. So we have Sparrow, Liam, or Hunter for the males. And then we have Haley, Annabelle, and Brian for the females. So leave a comment down in the section below which female or male you would like me to romance. Um, and I guess, you know, whoever has the most votes, I will, I guess we will go after that character in terms of romancing. I'm actually going to go ahead and head to the hot spring to regenerate our energy while we're waiting for the... Uh, the tavern to open so let's go do that okay well there's a lot of people at the bar I don't know that's the bakery guy you you at least the rain will wash away some of the animal droppings in the yard okay that's the guy that owns the animal place okay what if I talk to her across from the bar welcome to our tavern what can I get you any hey I can I can work for you do you have any part-time work my uncle Orion could possibly answer that question next time he's working. Thanks for the offer, though. Oh, so he has to... I'd like a drink. Can I have a drink? Don't really... Can't really afford... Oh, they're really cheap. Herbal tea? Yeah, let's get some herbal tea. Just, just one. Sure, why not? Okay, so he has to be working. So I guess... I don't know if he, like, works part of the day? And then... I have no idea. No idea. I don't know if he works part of the day and then like she works part of the day or if like only either of them work every so often. I have no idea. Okay, well let's go into the general store here. Let's see, what are you guys selling? Do you have like farming tools? What'd you say? Just look around at your own convenience. Everything that's got a red tag is up for sale. What's this? Doggy chow? No, I don't need any right now. What's this? A token for this freak's fortune a raffle? Sure! Uh, I don't know anything about the raffle, actually. Can we go back? I don't know. Can I... Can you tell me about the raffle? What is the raffle? No one's told you about the raffle? Well, it's a weekly drawing we host here at the general shop. The way it works is simple. Anytime during the week, come into the store and buy one of these three tokens sitting on the table. Each one's got a different value and a different payoff if you win big. Each Friday, I will draw one chip at random and broadcast the results over television. If yours is a lucky winner, you'll score some cash. You'll always have a 1 in 3 chance, and as I said, the amount you win will depend on which token you decide to buy. So what do you say? Um, sure. Why not? Did I tell her no? I, w I wanna... Oh, that's the wrong button. I did. I told her no. Yeah, we'll enter. Let's do the magpie token. Alright, thank you. See what else is she selling? Is this over here? What is this? A cloudy curtain? Nah. Royal bedspread. So that's another bedspread. What's this? What's this? An ocean runner. So stuff for your house. A stereo system. That's pretty cool. Sun rays. Nah. A fridge. A calendar. The fridge might be nice. 
It's a thousand gold. I don't have that. Do you have any part-time work? Can I work for you? No, I can't work for you. Okay, fine then. Be that way. I see how you are. I see how you are. Okay, well, since I can't find O'Brien right now, how about we go do some fishing? We can try our hand at fishing. I have no idea how to fish, but we'll just go up to the fishing spot um, and like the little fishing area right here. Is there a spot right here? No, that's just a bridge. Uh, I'm pretty sure there's a spot over here somewhere. Pretty sure. Let's run. Since we have stamina, we'll just we'll just run there. Pretty sure there's a fisherman spring, fishy spot in the fisherman spring. I could be wrong though. Uh, ocean front. We can fish here. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, here we go. We'll fish here. Alright, so how do I fish? Cast out the fishing rod for one hour? Holy crap, sure. Why not? A whole hour. What do I do? 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 Do I... Oh. Oh. Oh my. Okay, I have to actually cast out the... Yes! 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 Get my, get the fish, get the fish, get the fish, get the fish, ah, oh, no, no. So I just have to, oh man, can I cancel that? I don't, I don't know, I have no idea. Oh, boosh, get it, get it. Oh, why was it so, I don't know how to control this at all. No idea. No idea. Oh, yes! I caught one! I caught a tuna! I caught a tuna! That's it? Just one hour? We'll do it one more time. Why not? Yes! We'll fish! Fishy, fishy! Fishy, fishy! Fishy, fishy! Oh, no. Aw, oh, man. Okay. Darn it! Okay, so... I think I'm getting the hang of how to cast it out further. A little tricky at first. Come on, fishies. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Come on, fishy. Boosh. No, I did not do that in time. Did not do that in time at all. Come on, fishies. Yes, I caught another tuna! So I can only catch one fish an hour, which I guess is fine. Okay, so let's go visit the tavern one more time. And if Orion isn't there, then we'll just wait until the next day to see if we can get the recipe from Orion. Because I'm not gonna wait around forever and ever. The fishing's cool, though. I don't know if it automatically applied the bait or not. I could probably check in my inventory if I really wanted to. If I really wanted to... Let's see. That's the shop. We need to go to this side of the town. Midnight Tavern! Midnight Tavern! Here we go. Maybe he'll be in here. Orion? Oh, no, he's not in here. But there's other people here. How am I supposed to find him if he's just not working? Like, does he roam around, maybe? I have absolutely no idea. Okay, guys. Well, unfortunately, I think that's all the time we have for this episode. If you guys would like to support me, and if you guys would like to see more of World's Dawn... Be sure to leave a comment down in the section below. Tell me what you think of the game. Tell me whether or not you like it so far. All that good stuff. And don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done so already. Also, remember, I do want you guys to determine which character we're going to romance in the game. Uh, we have the choice between six different people, I believe. And they are... Uh, we have Hunter, Liam and Sparrow for the males, and then we have Annabelle, Haley, and Brian for the females. So make your choices down in the comment section below and I will review the comments to see which one has the most votes and we will go from there. Don't forget the game releases on January 25th on Steam and the links for the game is down in the comment, or not in the comment section, the description, as well as the link to their official website. So until then, I will see you guys soon. Bye.